Trucking can be lucrative for so many Americans, so we want to bring in an expert on trucking. He was the creator, host, and executive producer of the American Trucker TV series. Of course, we are talking about Rob Mariani, who joins us live now from Orlando. Rob, thank you so much for being with us. Hey, Nicole. Nice to be with you. Thanks for having me. All right. A lot of people are familiar with you. Tell us how you even got into trucking. Well, I mean, trucking uh, in the TV world, I mean, I my grandfathers were both truck drivers. I grew up in Milwaukee, so it was pretty much a blue collar upbringing for me. And I fell in love with trucks when I was just a little kid. And seeing uh, both my grandfathers driving uh, was sort of my motivation. By the time I get into high school, I, I was going into trucking and got into college. I started working at a, uh, uh, a warehouse, loading trucks, driving trucks, you know, moving trailers around. And I thought I was going in to the open road, but I, I didn't, I took sort of a detour, which kind of led me into eventually creating the TV show, American Trucker, which we did pretty much every kind of hauling and, and a lot more uh, uh, of the unconventional things in the, in the show that you would even believe. Well, like you know, yeah, and a lot of people watched it. A lot of people loved it. So, you know, a lot of people, though, don't realize the impact truckers have on the U.S., the supply chain. I mean, you mentioned yourself. You loaded them. You unloaded. You moved the trucks. So what, yeah. do we, what do you want Americans to really know about truckers? Well, I mean, we saw, it, you know, case in point over the last couple of years, how, how things got real crazy real fast with things like toilet paper, you know, everyday items that you just expect to go to the store and reach for and, and buy off the shelf. That's not magic that makes that happen. That's the trucking industry. Certainly the last people that will, uh, you know, in that line are the drivers themselves that haul it from point A to point B for the distribution of whatever it may be. Whether it's you putting a, a gallon of, of fuel in your car or you're buying, you know, potato chips, it's somebody with a steering wheel had something to do with that. So I've been singing the praises of the industry for a long time and, and um, I'm, 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 I'm a big advocate of them and, and I certainly don't take for granted all of the little small things that the trucking industry brings to all of us. Absolutely. You know, that's really what, you know, one of the reasons we're doing this all week. Now, you found success in this industry. You know, you kind of, as you said, did a spinoff, obviously made a good living. But, you know, everything's not, you know, roses and, and rainbows here. What's your advice to people who, you know, may be thinking about making a career change into trucking? Well, first, I would say go into it. I mean, if you want the, you know, the, the, the spirit of being an independent truck driver is still alive and well, there might be a lot more regulations than there were, you know, say a couple decades ago, but the freedom of the open road is still there, uh, no matter what happens with this crazy times that we're living in. So if you like to, to get out there and see the country, I mean, that, that is there for you and to be paid while you're doing it is still a, a lure for, I would say the vast majority of the drivers and now, um, and you guys have been doing a great job all week profiling the industry, which I'm, I'm so happy to see. Um, you've got drivers now that can step in to this vocation and make six figures, which yeah. is, that's crazy good money right there, Nicole. That, that's that's a career. Absolutely. Well, before we let you go, Rob, you are filming a new trucking themed series. Tell us about that. Well, I can say this. We filmed an awful lot. We're working on it. I don't want to jinx myself too much, but um, I'm excited about that. You know how the world of TV goes. It's it's kind of fickle. It can but, be fickle. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm definitely excited about it. There's a lot more uh, roads to hoe, if you will, with what I want to do in the subject matter of, of trucking. So hopefully, um, you know, the, well, something will come out real soon. I can't really say uh, right now today, okay. but if you go to semifreaks.com, that's basically a forum site that my buddy Brad and I have put together for people like anybody that loves trucks. We call ourselves semi freaks, and and it's sort of like a. <laughs> All right, you're not like a, not yeah, revealing just, a lot, Rob, but I have a feeling a lot of people will watch once it is finally revealed. Certainly appreciate it, Rob Mariani. Thank you so much for speaking with us. We appreciate it. Thank you. And our series does roll on all this week with fresh stories each and every day. Tomorrow, I'll be talking with Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg about our nation's truck drivers, supply chain, mask mandates, all of it. And I will ask your questions as well. So you have to submit them. Go to newsnationnow.com slash rush. Thank you for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.